So, Alexandros the Great has shown me today his Imperial Solar Sailor final. And uh, as you can see, it's got a whole bunch of big square sails. I didn't notice these at first, but it's got a bunch of these sort of semi-destroyed ones as well. I don't know if that's intentional or not, but um, if it is, it looks pretty cool. So yeah, keep that. Huh? Um, we've got little blocks of water here and there. It's quite an original looking design. I mean, he says he's done it himself, so uh, by hand as well, so no tools involved. He's just built this in the game. And um, yeah, I mean, at a distance, it looks like quite an interesting, you know, the model looks featured. And uh, when you get close, you can see what he's been doing with the, uh, with the ice crystal there. You see where the power is. I mean, to be honest, the sails are really big, and I wanted mine to be bigger. Um, I think this is a little bit too big to enter the regatta, but maybe he could scale it down with Smedit, which would be the first time somebody's taken a ship, and uh, it's the first time someone's taken a hand-built ship and uh, made it smaller <laughs> rather than bigger. And I don't know if that'll work or not. Maybe it'll look wrong. And but hey. Um, because it is a little bit over mass, I think, oversized. Uh, I did say 150, 150. We'll check it in a minute. Maybe it's within the box, and I overestimated the limit. <laughs> um, but, um, yeah, let's have a look at the insides. So, we think we found the door. So, uh, if we just park up. Oh, God, what's he moving it for? Don't move. down the tunnel what 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 is this what is this fog oh my god there's a there's a core that's actually quite cool it's like a steam effect are they beacons Oh, it's a bit of a whiteout, I know, guys, but I think it's supposed to be a fog effect. And it does work, it's just a little bit overbearing. I was thinking, what the heck's going on here? But yeah, I think that actually does work. If that's what you wanted to create was like a fog... Do you know what, I'm going to make a decontamination room. But but anyway, that aside, that's that's actually fair play. That's the first thing I've seen so far, which has been like, yeah, that's really good. That is really good. I mean, yeah, I know, it is a cool model and all. But that, that there was creative. Right, let's see if he's got anything else for me to see. I think I found the hangar. Yeah. Oh, God. Who did that? Right. So, yeah, it's a pretty basic hangar. Yeah, he was right. So to be fair, that's actually a pretty cool solar sail ship. Um, I'm going to have to check on the dimensions just to make sure that it's not too big. But uh, I wouldn't say no, and, unless it's massively over, of course. Um, let's, uh, I forgot to double check it. Let's, uh, let's just check that now. Okay, so we've uh, got into the uh, weapons computer in build mode. I'm just going to check out the stats. So, it's got 68,000 mass and 30, 345,000 thrust. So yeah, it's way over spec for the regatta. But maybe if he added mass um, or reduced the thrust, um, it's got a length of 449, height 415, width 283. So yeah, it's, it's massively oversized. What I would say is reduce it down to the 150 box and you might find that actually this would work still so I'm going to suggest that to him you never know he might he's got plenty of time to build a smaller a smaller sailor um, but to be honest I mean I like the design there's nothing wrong with it it's just a bit too big for the for what we're doing the collisions will cause problems and there's going to be like five or six of us at the very least so thanks to Alexandros for bringing me this one to look at and um, just a reminder to people again to check out the regatta if you're interested come to mushroomfleet.co.uk 
I'll get you white listed. The idea is build it in single player and come show it to us. Now, this is too big for the regatta, but uh, he's spoken to another player on the server and they've said they're going to attempt to shrink it down. So who knows what it'll come out looking like after that. So I for one can't wait actually, because this has got a very unique style to it. So anyway, thanks for watching and I will see you next time.